back in 91 for getting beaten by the LAPD. But unfortunately, the he's a she. And Rodney King wasn't a real person. As you can see, these are not the eyes of a human being. And this is not the face of a man. So Rodney King, King was cloned back then as well as a female. Rodney King was a transvestite. That story about this character created by the Illuminati being beaten was simply meant to cause divisions. Riots within the races. Black folks against white. And an uproar. Because there's no need for all this beating to take place. Even the cameraman who somehow got this on video Rodney getting beaten like that was definitely a clone too. Believe that. The demons were all in on it because this was an attack on the Jews. No, Rodney King wasn't in on it because it's not a real person. But the real Jews, real black folks, is where the focus was. Satan has been attacking black people for the longest because God made a covenant with Abraham who was black, which is the line of Christ Yahshua where he came from. So Christ's spirit was put into Mary's womb, who was black, and who was a um a female that was in the line of Abraham, David, Isaac, Jacob. All of them. So that's where this attack comes from. The promised seed was in the line of Abraham, who was black, and Christ was black on earth. And so that's why there's a, uh, an attack nowadays on black people as well. Real ones, that is. But Satan uses fake ones to do that. And trannies as well. So that's why this character, Rodney King, has. A pointed chin and narrow jaws and thick eyebrows on this female's face as well as an M carved into the hairline for Mason. Can't we all just get along? Them demons no doggone well. All that was set up and created to cause racial warfare. See? All this character needs is to remove the mustache and add a ponytail and you got yourself a woman. Clearly, Rodney King is a female. That's why you got this curved hairline. And they always put thick eyebrows on a woman. Again. The cheeks of a female. As well as posture. Yeah, so they did the same thing with Trayvon Martin in many other cases. It doesn't always have to be racially based, but when it's when it is that, it's an attack on the Jews. And the main thing is fear. Cuz God is love, Satan is fear. So, there was a riot and uproar with black folks retaliating because of the injustice. White people were scared. Not all of them, but enough of them were. And black folks were scared as well because they. What Satan wanted was accomplished. It was to cause fear, mass hysteria. You see that this is a fake person. Look at Rodney King's eyes. All are set up, all created. This is a number, just a, a robotoid here. That's why you got the synthetic skin. This is not real skin. The nose is altered. All of that. 
It doesn't matter if a clone gets beat because it's not a real person. And guaranteed that the demon that was inside Rodney King, because all clones are demons, the, the clone body is a shell that the demon is inside of. That demon was in on it inside Rodney. So, these are the cops who played a part. You see his eyes. He's fake. He's fake. And this is a woman right here. Tranny. There are numerous trannies in the police department. Many of them. This is an old black lady in her 50s. Yeah, but it's supposed to be Rodney King. Clearly by the cheeks... And the jawline, the pointed chin, the feminine hair, as well as overall feminine profile, you see this is an old black lady with a goatee. Thick eyebrows and a goatee. Look at that. If that ain't a woman's skin... And look at the eyes. Robotoid. A woman with a mustache. Very feminine hair on Rodney King as well. So. Just no need at all. To have felt sorry for Rodney King. Because it wasn't a real person. And the supposed death. Of this character. Dying at the bottom of a swimming pool. That was another lie. Because Rodney was fake to begin with. So. Anything that them reptilians and spew is pure.